Hi, welcome back. So this week I want to talk about intentional relationships and this is something that is really near and dear to my heart because I think that it is 100% our responsibility as a team leader to create the team cohesion and collaboration opportunities and psychological safety within our teams and more now than ever since we're remote, intentional relationships are really the only way to do that. And there's some pieces of intentional relationship that maybe sounds a little bit redundant. So to be intentional, obviously, is to be active in creating and cultivating a relationship. Relationships don't just happen. And while I think we all know this up here, I don't think we necessarily know it here. And so being able to go be active and in the workplace with our teams is much harder now than it used to be with everybody being remote. But I would also argue that we always needed to be intentional in our relationship building. So why is this important on a team? If you're intentional about your relationship building, people feel drawn to you. They feel warmed. They feel connected. That level of psychological safety starts to get created and so does the trust that's necessary to have that really strong, solid, innovative team. So I want to hear from you on some thoughts on how you could get more creative and actively intentionally building relationships in this more remote work that we have.